Hi, hi all, hi guys, hi gals. I want to talk with you about the longer we do the most deepest of true worships, that's when healing healings come. So so really there is there is no real tactic in regards to healing there, there's all different types of tactics some some of them are not even in the bible or some 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 or someone that wants wants to be a judge will probably say it's not biblical it's not there's no set rule some i've, I've heard of people not speaking and just laying their hands on someone and they end, ended up healing being healed I think there are parts in the Bible, there's one part in the Bible where the Apostle Paul healed with, with his shadow. You would have to research that one online. But they, but you can also be healed through worship, deep, deep worship as well. But like I said, there's no set thing with, there's no set thing when it comes to healing. Some 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 healings happens now and instantly. And I think I have preached about, I have spoken about this before, or preached about this, I preached about this before. You know, you've also got to give God time to 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 let to to be healed. Sometimes God doesn't want to heal at all, and it and it and it's and it's a thorn in the flesh. But even it, but whatever it is, whatever whatever it is, or whenever you're waiting for your healing. Just obey God in the in the obey the Lord in the little things, and see what happens in the outcome. Don't be frustrated about not receiving your healing instantly, or or many years down the line, or wasting eight years of your life if you if you would like to call, if you would like to call it that eight years of your life, worshiping God and being in the church and not and not receiving your healing, and not getting what you want out of Christianity. You know, we should we should try our best to come come to God out of humbleness, out of humbleness, not 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 just about not not just about what we what we can get out of God, and then leave leave at the leave leave him at the door, or leave him in church. We should we should really want to. It would be great if we could just come before God just to just to serve him because if we're gonna if we if we do things outside the church we're still serving anyway because if we do things because because then if anybody if anybody is if anybody is working or, or has a job they're serving they're serving people so it's the same thing so so just keep on keep on worshiping god and keep on honor honoring god because eventually your healing will come that's if it's that's if it's god's will but don't, but don't be upset about it but if you if your healing doesn't come doesn't come right now but just keep on keep on looking forward and and just take each day as it is and 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 if you're not comfortable with 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 if you're not comfortable in in it, if you're not comfortable where you where you're at at the moment where you're where you're at at the moment and still waiting for your healings just just keep on waiting because in those times of in those times of waitings or waiting you 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 we can learn a lot and, and learn learn many things through that waiting period sometimes god is just building you up and getting you ready for other things whilst he is he is maybe eventually healing you but it's a case of just being being obedient to the little things like like the bible says if you're if you're if you're obedient to the small thing obedient to the small things and God will give you the bigger things to 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 be responsible for. 
you know god tests us through everything to see if we're still following him and also if we don't follow him god god brings brings an area of protection around us just to win us back freely as long, if we freely choo choose him again you know god the lord doesn't do things by force and by rule 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 he doesn't rule by rule by force or by an iron fist god rules freely and freely in love and it's down to us to choose God. God chose us from the very foundation of the earth. But we then, we then, as human beings, choose him, choose him as, as our personal Lord and Savior. So, if anything, it's the first choice for us as human beings to choose God. So, yeah. That's really all I have to say in this video. So let me pray before I finish. So Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy that you put upon us from past, present and future. Pray heal us right now, Father, and in your own time, in Jesus' name. Pray restore us, body, pray, your body, pray you restore our bodies right now, Father, in Jesus' name, to its original form. Whatever situation or, or healings that's needed, that's needed, that's needed, that's need that's in need at the, at this present time whoever's listening i pray for healing and restoration oh god pray i pray against lack of belief oh god lack of lack of belief in you lack of belief in 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 your healings oh god and i pray you show oh god your 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 i pray you show your yourself real to each and every one of us oh god and and everyone that's watching i pray you show yourself really in it i pray you show yourself real in our emotions oh god and i plead blood jesus christ in that situation make yourself new to us oh god and refresh your soul god and no lord i plead blood jesus christ in that situation pray not to fall upon that situation i pray these things all in jesus name we pray amen god bless you guys gals bye for now